This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Mary Nelson with 3 News Now, and here's a look at what's happening. Dozens of women in our area claim they're being targeted. Intimate photos and videos are being posted on pornographic websites without their consent. Law enforcement agencies like Fremont Police are investigating to see if Nebraska law was broken. Currently, Fremont Police say they know of one victim, but several people outside their jurisdiction have contacted the agency. 3 News now talked to women who say they're getting messages from someone claiming to hack camera rolls and Snapchats, threatening girls with sexually explicit photos of them. In Nebraska, it's against the law to distribute sexually explicit photos or videos of someone without their consent. Omaha police are still looking for who's responsible for this crashing a car into a house in North Omaha last night. Officers arrived at 42nd and Spencer a little after 730. When they got there, they found the car on its side next to the house engulfed in flames. Police say the people in that car took off from the scene. No reports of injuries. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swain, mid-60s overnight, an isolated storm possible, mainly southeast. Winds out of the east at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Back to the low 80s on Tuesday, spotty rain and storms for some. Could produce some localized heavy rain, but it's going to be feast or famine with that. Most staying dry tomorrow with a 30% aerial coverage both days. Look at how much cooler it is this week than last week. Mid-80s expected. Uh, it's getting closer to average for this time of year, which is in the mid to upper 80s. Breezy conditions on Sunday, uh, warmer next week, mid-90s return.